That's great hair, dude. What's your suggestion? Give me, a, give me something to talk about. This is the show is, right? I have to ask. Truck drivers? Are you a truck driver? I do the show a little bit different. I ask you for a suggestion, and then I question why you asked that. Are you a truck driver? This is a lot lizard you met. <laughs> she sucked your dick through 18 holes, so you got her fucking teeth fixed? <laughs> Damn, I'm just kidding, but the crowd thinks you're a whore. Wow, be nice. She's sweet. <sighs> What's up, black dudes? <laughs> God, you ought to uh, suggestion. Why? <laughs> you're a gay guy? But you love musicals? You might want to revisit if you're a gay guy. What's your favorite musical? Uh, damn, uh... Are you realizing you don't know any musicals? Are you having so many run through your head right now? Like, I don't know, South Pacific has a great score, but I love the energy of West Side. I was sort of a phantom guy when I was young. Lay Miz. What's your favorite musical? Grease the musical. Grease the musical? Now, the play? The movie. That doesn't count. Remember when Rosie O'Donnell was like a 50-year-old Rizzo? <laughs> this is your boyfriend? I mean your musical partner. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Get two tickets for In the Heights. I'm coming right from work. Did you know this guy loved musicals, or is this him coming out to you? I was a theater kid, so I... You were a theater kid? Why? You want to fuck fat chicks with glasses? <laughs> you're not going to fuck the actresses. You're going to have to get a key grip for a fucking curtain puller. <laughs> These black guys are judging the hell out of you right now. And it's raining, so they think we all smell like wet dogs. <laughs> this is your girlfriend? Interracial relationship? What's your suggestion, bro? It's not your girlfriend. You said it like you thought I would know it was a joke. Oh, yeah, totally, idiot. No. She has to move? That's not true. How do you, do you know this guy at all? You came by yourself. You came with two black guys, but they set you with a white dude instead. Do you think the owners of this place are trying to get this guy killed? <laughs> you could ask her out, but you gotta get through these two motherfuckers first. How do you know these two guys? Where at? What's that black of a place in Austin? It's like finding a synagogue downtown. It's impossible here. Where do you work? No, Nike Town? Okay, don't ask. <laughs> don't be racist. If you don't laugh, you're racist. Where do you work at? Oh, shit. Can I make guesses? TSA. <laughs> Waffle House, 2 a.m. shift. These are all places I want to see black people at. Because <laughs> they guys got style. What's the actual place you work? The post office. That wasn't what I was expecting at all. Are you guys mailmen? You work sorting the mail. You don't work at the post office. I'm sorry. She said she worked with you guys. You don't work together at all. We're in tech? Nice, what kind? Gigantic dildos? <laughs> Are you guys models for gigantic vibrators? <laughs> this guy fucks toothless lot lizards. Look at those worlds colliding, huh? Who'd have thunk it? Couple of black tech dudes sitting next to a fucking hooker murderer? 
Not you. He's invested in you. He's keeping you. But the rest got to go. <laughs> when he comes home with that look in his eye, you know. Her name was Cassie. She was so scared. Some of this crowd started getting emotional about Cassie. She was just trying to get herself through med school. <laughs> I like getting the crowd emotional over someone who doesn't exist. She's not real, everybody. She had a twin brother who could feel it. He knew she was gone. <laughs> Is this trucker actually your boyfriend? Married. Shut up. You're so young. How old are you? 29. That's older than I thought you were. <laughs> Seems appropriate. How old are you, dude? 29 also. And a truck driver. Badass. Does she go with you? Hell yeah. Fucking suck his dick while he's hauling brute. You ever blow him while he's driving? Yeah? Why'd you say it all ashamed? The fuck is White Claw sponsoring this night? Who the fuck's he? Usually girls are more judgmental. They're like, yeah, suck his cock. Suck the shit out of it, bitch. You're by yourself, dude. You need to get yourself a lot, lizard. Get her some new fucking teeth, dude. Get her new grill. She'll live with you and suck your cock while you drive. I feel like I got my dick sucked when I was driving when I was younger. I feel like I did that, but now, I don't know if they've changed cars. But I couldn't picture a, a way for my dick to get sucked while I'm driving where my stomach wasn't making her right ear push the horn the entire time. They're gonna know we're coming. <laughs> Sir, you look like you know some sort of a dancing karate. What do you want to talk about? Horse girls? What do you mean by that? Girls who enjoy horses? or girls who enjoy horses. Because I've never been to Peru. <laughs> you ever watch a video of a girl on a horse? Never. What is this, your mom next to you or something you don't wanna tell her? It's your girlfriend. You don't want her to know. You've never even peeked. You've seen it over there in the recommended section. Dude, they come a lot. <laughs> Dude, buckle up. <laughs> I think I'm supposed to bring Jeremiah out. I think I've been up here for 30 minutes. I don't know, I'm stoned. Everybody, how about Jeremiah Watkins coming back out here?